Good morning, everyone. Me, I'm uh, Sadraki Yabre from Burkina Faso. I'm presenting some, our work in the field of uh, peace building in our uh, country on behalf of uh, two other brothers uh, with our team, uh, uh, Valentin and Kishin Sida. All are from Burkina Faso. Uh, our group, GED, uh, is a group action to impact uh, development uh, and peace. Our action is uh, a natural resource uh, management. Uh, what the presentation that I'm going to, to deliver is uh, on a conflict related to the exploitation of natural resources and is uh, focused on uh, mining uh, exploitation. As uh, Claudia said yesterday, when we were at the reception in the mining region, yeah, it is uh, uh, about what our work. And in our country, uh, the mining extraction is related to many conflicts. And uh, in the case that we, we are working on is about uh, the conflict uh, uh, between uh, miners and uh, industrial companies. Uh, we know that uh, people uh, think that all natural resources in her country is for belong to the, the, the population of the country. And uh, uh, in other side, the government think that these uh, natural resources uh, is for the government and government give this uh, resource to who uh, he, he, he wants. And the conflict uh, uh, is from that. Because uh, in our country, uh, miners, sorry, yeah, in our country, uh, the miners, local people, uh, people that extract the, the gold, uh, or the thing that this resource is in the land, in the area, in the field, and they can exploit the resource as they want. And if they want to start this exploitation, they don't need to look for permits or license before start working. Uh, in, but in the process, uh, what can I say, legal process, you have to look for a license or permit before start working. And the conflict is from that. Because when the companies uh, come, they get contact with the government and they, took, they take a uh, uh, license with the government. And when they, they want to go now to the field to start working, they will face the local people that already are in the field to, to work in and uh, stressing the, the money. And this uh, uh, conflicts come from that because they will, the, the, the local people think that they are discriminated with, by the government because they don't consult them before you know, allow other people to come in the area to work. Uh, sometimes there are uh, we are to force displacement of these uh, local people, and they think that uh, they, uh, with this uh, situation they will lose their business, or many of them are frustrated because they force them to leave the living area, and from that conflicts occurred. Sometimes it is between these local people and. Uh, the mine, uh, mining companies, or due to this situation, some will accept to be enrolled with, uh, in the terrorism to fight against government or to fight even, uh, against uh, mining companies because they think that they don't have enough uh, power to resist. The, the only way that they, they see to resist or to fight is to go to terrorism and, and fight again. And this is uh, the situation that we are trying to, 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 to issue. And 
we think to set and to, to put in place a, a system that we call a, a, a one system that uh, is about to to help this money to get a, yeah, you can see how the artisanal extraction system that is uh, is done in our country is in our country and sometimes this is a conflict that occur when the you see we have a in controlled installation of a local uh, miners and we have and I think also that uh, the coming of uh, Companies are in fair, and we have the demarcation in the in the delimitation in the field, and that is true. The company will come and say, say uh, this area is uh, our properties, but uh, any demarcation or delimitation is done on the field, and it is by this situation that the, the issue come, because the population that will say uh, we don't we don't see nothing in the area that show. The place is your properties. Then, how can we do at that situation? It is why we think to to put this to develop this application a system of alert mine. This is uh, our country, and the yellow parts are different uh, licenses of uh, gold uh, exploitation. And if you Look, we have different kind type of licenses. The red one is for exploitation. The the yellow is for uh, exploration research. We share this application with uh, local miners, and it helps them to know the place where they are living or the place where they are working. If the place is uh, up, is uh, properties of. Uh, big company or the, the place is free for work and this will help to uh, avoid conflicts that are related to the working of the two uh, parties. It is simple to use. Eh? If uh, the man open the application or this information are already in the application, he just to click on this point and the application will zoom in the place where he is located. And when the application zoom to where he's located, he will know that he is inside of a permit or no. If he is inside of a permit, he had to find another place to, to work. If not, uh, later he will face uh, a, a big company because it is already a, a properties of someone. This is the work. And also, if he type up, on the if it is a license he wants uh, he still want to work in the place he can type on the figure the feature here and he will the application will display the information about uh, the the owner of the of the permit and if he decide to contact the owner of the permit to discuss and see how in this condition he can still work on the area he can get the contact here, the name and the uh, yes, many information on the owner of the permit. They can discuss and and, and fix some yes some condition to allow him to still work in the place. This is how the, the application work. And uh, actually, many managers and are uh, using the application. Also, some uh, NGOs who are working in the field of uh, this uh, to fix this kind of issue, they are also using to before you go in the field and and and, and contact uh, uh, different parties uh, in this uh, uh, field. May, uh, but when you, we start uh, sharing the application with the different parties, we. The companies recommend us to add some other information that is about the different uh, sites of uh, artisanal mining uh, extraction. Those who are already 
in the field. They want us to add this information in the application, but it is why we didn't, hey, sorry. Yeah, these points, the red points, it is just an example. It is not, uh, we, don't, we didn't do yet the, this work because it is a recommendation from the, the, com the companies. They want to add these points that can could represent the different places where miners are already installed in the field and are working. Then, if they have this, this information before go to ask for license, they will already know if the place that they want is already occupied by miners or no, and in which condition they can still uh, get the license and get a good collaboration to work without uh, avoiding the conflict uh, between the two parties. And also, doing this work will allow, will help us to, to know because our country, some uh, site of uh, artisanal exploitation are already are considered as a, a terrorist nest because some terrorists are getting profit of this kind because it is in the bush, uh, no. Uh, Town close to these places, then it is easy to, yeah. Then it is also can also help us to uh, get this kind of information. And we can also uh, get information about uh, these the different sites that already have been the subject of a, a conflict between uh, companies and miners. This is a, a perspective what we could need next. To, as work to do and to add to the application that is already done. I think, yeah, I want to end. Thank you. Thank you.